Got two Cutco knives, one Henkel Para Cutco pruners, which I did not know they made, and some Fiskar hedge trimmer and Fiskar pruners in rough shape. Well, not rough, just nasty and rusty. Well, the market's been open about 10 minutes. We had uh, four five vendor knives and two uh, processing blades for another vendor. And this is our first real customer with some nice lopers. I'll put them on that doodad right there. They'll be cleaned up in a minute. Well, it's 7.38. We headed home from the market. We had a pretty good market. Started a little bit slow, but damn, it got wild. I might even I might even had a river. I just got a text from a guy. <laughs> it says, Max, I just dropped some knives off at your, in your box. God, more knives. It's crazy today. Well, let's see what's in the box. It's all wrapped up tight. Feels like a few, though. Stand by. We'll get inside. We'll take a look at them. Well, we got eight wrapped up in this, whatever this is. They're all Heckel Internationals, except for, we got two LC Germains. We got this one, Germain, and this one's Germain. And well, we'll take it back. We got some Taiwan here, and one big, new-looking, Oh, I mean, uh, shun. And it's got a chip right there. Somewhere. Not Jack. I can't even find it now. Oh, there it is. Not too bad a chip. She's a big boy though, like 12 incher. Okay, pretty good day. A ripper plus 10 and then eight. I like it. Nice Zilla. Mm -hmm. Well, Thursday brings us five big restaurant knives and a bag of knives, polka dotted bag of knives. Feels like five or six or seven in there. Stand by. Well, it's got 11 tickets in it. I was mistaken. It's got a Buck Light 422. It's got a Benchmade 550. It's got a Sog Flash 422. A China Para. A Purple Para. 
two Heckle Internationals, I mean, yeah, two Heckle Internationals, and four I never heard of before. It says EX something. Okay, we've got a little afternoon action. I'll get back to you.